Welcome to Income Solutions. My name is Jake, and we're going to be talking kind of where Mistastic is going. If you have recently heard about Mistastic and you haven't gotten started uh, for various reasons, this might be the right video for you. If you're already a Mistastic enthusiast, you also might enjoy this video. So, a little background, real quick. Uh, I first started creating Mistastic videos. Uh, over two years ago because when I found out about Mistastic, there wasn't a whole lot of content on YouTube. So I purchased myself a couple T-beams and started down that path. Along the way, I've done a lot of videos about testing, setting up different types of nodes, trying to do an airborne node off of a drone, all kinds of different things. And I've always had a passion for emergency communications, not just Mestastic, but other mesh and other types of radios. Uh, I'm also an amateur radio operator, those type of things. So I created this channel, Income Solutions. One of the biggest barriers for Mestastic has been the fact that there is a technical side to it, and there still is, but some of those are starting to dissolve as the popularity goes from niche to more mainstream, at least in the communication space mainstream you know uh, you may not see these you know at Walmart or something like that in the future but they've become a lot more mainstream so we're going to talk about some of that and why I think that's awesome because the solution that this these have uh, created to the whole communication world that I really think is awesome is the fact that it's operated through an application on your phone. And that is a lot easier to convince family, friends, associates, whatever, to use than handing them uh, you know, a mobile radio and tell them to mount it into their vehicle. They're really like, I'm not mounting that thing into my vehicle and, and then mounting an antenna and doing all that crazy stuff. No, that's not me, that's not what I'll do. Um, I know amateur radio operators that uh, their family members won't even allow them to mount external antennas on their vehicles. <laughs> so, um, and they've been hams for a long time. So, it, you know, it, there's tons of barriers out there. Um, some of our, uh, them are us and our loved ones. And some are the fact that maybe we just don't want to go through the process of learning how to solder or, um, program or do things like that, well, Mistastic can be a little buggy, right? It's an open source system or program project uh, that there's constant updates of firmware and so on and so forth. And with one firmware update might create new bugs, remove old bugs and new ones up here. Uh, so they recently just had to roll back one of the firmware updates because there was a lot of problems. But I don't mind that stuff. I enjoy it. And I know that could be challenging for some. The real barrier I feel like lately has been the, uh, as this popularity grows, is the people looking for the off-the-shelf solution like the Tieco. The Tieco, this one here is a little modified, but is a great starter setup because of the fact that it uh, is, comes ready to go. Today, we're going to look at some more options because the industry has recognized the demand and they are answering that demand. Uh, in addition, we'll talk small business side too. So let's check it out. Over here on Rockland, which just disclaimer, I am affiliated with Rockland and Rack Wireless. So Rack now offers, they through a partnership with Rockland, uh, the Rack Wireless Wiz Mesh Pocket all-in-one Mastastic handheld, okay, handheld, okay, uh, um, nine, 950 megahertz radio with lower antenna and GPS. This is a ready-to-go device. We'll talk specs here in a second, but this goes to show you how the industry has recognized the demand for more ready-to-go off-the-shelf devices, and they are now starting to produce those at what I would consider uh, a reasonable price. The Wiz block or the Wiz, um, yeah, the Wiz block, which is the internal parts of this, is one of my favorite LoRa radios. 
uh, for the fact that they're very versatile and they're the um, they have a lower power consumption than your uh, ESP32 boards because they're the NRF52s. Uh, that doesn't make any sense. Just know that one is more power hungry than the other. This one is less power hungry. Uh, so if you look here, it's pre-flashed. It's got the Wismont core standard one pre-flashed with uh, Mestastic firmware. Of course, you usually you got to update it when you get it if you so choose. Uh, it's got an OLED screen. It's got the GPS, the GNS location module. It's got an on and off uh, user or user control button and on and off switch, which is a nice feature because uh, a lot of these, even if you build them yourself, adding in a switch is you know something you have to wire in, solder, and do yourself. So that is a thing that a lot of people don't do uh, when they're building these. I, I don't a lot of times. So. Um, and the enclosure and antenna so you're ready to go it has a 3200 milliamp hour battery which is cool a USB-C charger to like just like any other was block so pretty awesome if you pre-order you're going to save 15 percent, and you can pick a free t-shirt uh which it's got the sizes there so why as i mentioned awesome off the shelf ready to go pretty cool you could jump over and say hey well i could get a T Echo for less, a whole lot less, uh, standard configuration, but they're always out of stock. So maybe if you really want a T Echo instead, you go ahead and you hit the email me when available, or you go on to Lily Go order it. It'll usually let you order it and it'll just, you'll get it when they're available. So, but it's, they got your money. So they're going to, they, I've found they're pretty good about getting it to you in a reasonable amount of time. Just you might get on a wait list of the first or wherever it's at on the production line. If you're looking to support small businesses, Etsy is always a great place. But I found uh, this individual's business uh, through Instagram, I believe. I think he started following me. Uh, and then I was like, wow, this is cool. So we'll go over and... So we'll shop their Mestastic stuff because he creates uh, the Mestastic, the Nomad complete device with the Heltec version three loaded Mestastic case, battery, everything. You can pick your colors, which is cool for seventy dollars US. Um, and you see here is you know two hundred milliamp hour battery, all assembled, ready to go, sent to you. So I think that's pretty cool. Uh, and the price is right. Uh, or if you're looking uh, for just the case, you can order the case. Uh, I don't see a selection for colors on the case, but I would imagine you could message uh, this business and they would be willing to, and orders over $50, ship for free in the US, I'm sure. But they are uh, made in Oregon, uh, which is my home of origin. Uh, where I was born. Uh, so uh, I'm partial to that. But so, quick wrap up as you saw there, there's uh, tons of options now for off the shelf. I think that is outstanding. And it shows you that the future of the Mestastic project is strong. It's going to continue to grow. Uh, you can tell on YouTube, there are videos everywhere. Um, like I said, in the beginning, when I first started making mine, I was one of a few. Uh, and now I'm one of many and some big time channels. So I'm getting dwarfed in the, uh, the algorithms for sure. So it, I do this for fun. I don't do this for, <laughs> for a living. So I hope you have enjoyed what you, uh, you've seen here. If you're looking to collaborate, work with other people, I have a telegram group. You can check that out. Link will be down below. You can check out our website. You can check out our social media accounts. You can always hit that thumbs up, which helps us out a little bit. And subscribe to the channel if you want to watch more videos like this and many others. So thanks for watching. See you next time.